Hey everybody, as always, I hope you're doing well out there. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can set reference values for your altimeter or barometer on your Sunto Core watch. Now, I'm using the Sunto Core Alpha Stealth model. It doesn't matter which version you've got. This video should be the same for everybody. So why would you need to do this? This watch is going to be tracking your barometric pressure and your altimeter using sensors that are built onto the watch. You shouldn't have to do this, but maybe you're out hiking and you see a sign that says current elevation is this. You look at your watch and it doesn't match what's being shown on your watch. You can actually adjust that reference value on your watch so that your watch is accurate to where you are. You can do the same thing with barometric pressure. If you have a local weather station or a different weather uh, sensor that you're using and it doesn't match the barometric pressure on your watch, you can adjust it. And I'm going to show you how to do that. Now, there's a couple of different ways to get to this. I'm going to show you the way that I prefer and recommend. So first thing we need to do is let's go look at our altimeter and barometer. You can see that I'm currently at 194 feet. Well, let's say I'm out and I'm uh, hiking up a mountain and I get to a trail and it says current elevation 200 feet. I know that my watch is a little bit off of where I should be so I can go adjust that. The way we're going to do it is if you're in the altimeter barometer screen, you can simply press and hold the view button, which is your bottom left button on the watch. If you're in any other mode screen, the time mode or the compass or the altimeter barometer, you can always press and hold the middle button, which is your mode button, and that'll take you to your menu options. That's the way that I recommend. That's kind of the default way to get to most of your menu stuff on this watch. Once you're in your menu options, we're just going to press the down button a couple of times till we get to altimeter barometer. Again, we're going to press the mode button to select it. The first option you should see is reference. Press mode to select it, and then you're going to have two options in here your altitude or sea level. Sea level is going to be your barometric pressure. So if I choose altitude, it should show your current altitude reading based off of what you're getting on your watch sensor. You can simply press the up button or down button and adjust it accordingly. So if I wanted to adjust mine to 200, for example, I would just get it on that value and I can press mode to save it or I can press the upper left hand button to save it and return back to my main screen. In this case, I'm not going to save mine. I'm just going to put it back to uh, 197. Actually, if I don't want to save it, I can simply press the back button and back out of it. I'll show you just for reference sake what the sea level looks like. If we go to sea level instead of altitude, it basically looks the exact same, but instead of showing your altitude, you're going to be showing your barometric pressure. Mine's being displayed in inches of mercury. Depending on what your units are that you're displaying, you should see yours in that value. Again, you can use the up or down button to adjust it to match whatever value you're trying to set for your reference. Again, once you're done, you can press the middle mode button or you can press this button to save and get back. I hope that makes sense. Again, this isn't something you should normally have to do, but if you're getting any invalid readings or you've got a reference that shows that your watch is off, this is where you can adjust that.